So before we start this tutorial, uh, if you don't have Explorer and Properties open, you can just find them under the View tab and just click on Explorer and Properties. And then this will open up what we need. So just go onto the right side of your screen. Your UI should be under your starter GUI. And then you should have a screen GUI with a frame. Now this frame, if you open it up, this will have all of your frame elements. So maybe you have like some text or an image. Uh, so to create an exit button, what we're going to do is just go under your frame, the frame that you want to close. We're just going to click the plus and we're going to enter in a text button. Uh, this text button is going to be our exit button. So you can just put it wherever you want. I usually like it on the top right and then just resize it to whatever you want. For this text button, we can just rename it to something like exit, just like that. And then if you click on your button and then you can scroll down to your properties of it. Here, you can change different things. For example, the background color, maybe I'll make that red. And then if I go down over here into the text, I can make that a capital X. And then maybe I want like the text color to be completely white. And then maybe I want the text to be scaled. Um, so as you can see, my exit button looks like that right now. Um, yours can look like whatever you want. It just needs to be a button. Uh, so once you're done playing around with your exit button, just go to your exit button, click on the plus and enter in a local script. Let's rename this local script to something like exit. Uh, and then you can just write what I write. You can zoom in just like a little bit. So we're going to start off with having a variable for our exit button. So it's going to be local exit equals to script.parent. And then we're going to have a variable for the frame we want to close. So that's going to be local frame equals to exit dot parent. And now we're going to write very simple code to close the frame. So this is going to be exit dot mouse button one click clunk connect function. We're going to put in brackets and then go down the line. And then we're just going to write frame dot visible equals to false. And that is all you have to do. So now if I go test it out in the game, you see this is your frame. And if I just go hover my mouse over the exit button, if I click on it, the frame disappears. So yeah, that'll be it for this tutorial. Thanks for watching.